Hello, Call of Duty fans. Wildtail here. Welcome to Session Destroy and uh, Playlist without the Exorcist. We're going to destroy these dudes and uh, it's going to be fun. And today we are going to talk about the ASM-1. That's right. And I'm going to tell you why I believe it's the best gun in the game. Why is the reason? You know, Because I think this gun is good but doesn't cross the line between good and overpowered. Okay? So it's a very nasty gun, and uh, the other gun that is really one of the most used SMGs is the KF-5. So we got these two kings of SMGs here in, in Advanced Warfare. So one of the main reasons why I believe the ASM-1 is the best is because it fits the Advanced Warfare idea, or what I like to, I like to call the Advanced Warfare theme, which is fast-paced craziness you know if you're playing on, uh, on a regular playlist you know people flying around all, all over the place you know everything is fast you know the enemy is spawning they're like back at, at your spawn in like two seconds so everything is chaotic everything is fast everything is crazy so I believe this gun fits that theme and before that before we keep looking we keep actually talking about it look at this clutch 1v3 there we go we're gonna save the round and we're gonna put up on a, on a show for for my team so I love 1v3 clutches Actually, if you look badass, <laughs> or one before, one before, whatever it is, I think it's badass. So, anyways, so the ASM one fits the advanced warfare theme. You know, everything, everything is crazy. Close quarters. You know, maps like this one. You know, uh, let's say Detroit. You know, everything is close quarters. So, of course, you're gonna go SMG. The, I think this game uh, map layout uh, fits a lot for the SMG. In previous Call of Duties, I told you and I gave you tips for uh, holding low line of sight and, and, and this and that and all that is useless here in advanced warfare because of the exosuits you know so you get like really high up in the uh, the ceiling over there and uh, so it's not the same so you have to you have to change that, the way you play because of that okay and once again I believe the SMGs are the, the, some of the the best weapons to use in this game because you want the fire rate you know the crazy fire rate that's why like I said in my previous Advanced Warfare video, that's why the Val 27 was one of the favorites as well because it felt like an SMG. It was a good gun for rushing. So if you try to use the LMG, you're gonna feel so weird because you know you're not gonna be holding down those those line of sights, those choke points like you were doing in previous Call of Duties. So you have to just keep looking up in the sky, see if you can catch the enemy. You know, so it's it's kind of crazy. For you got the plus, you got the heaviness of the LMG. So it's just not the same as as, as previous Call of Duties. Yes, you have to change the way you play. But once once we look at that fr from that perspective, it's like well, this game is actually telling me to play with an LMG. It's asking asking me to rush, to be aggressive, you know, fast pace, you know, extra suit stuff, you go through doors really quick and so it's you pretty much in a very nice way you're forced to use LMG to, to be mobile, to be quick, you know, maybe a shotgun as well. So <clears throat> so that's why, you know, it's it's it fits, you know, the ASM one and the KB5 fits the uh, advanced warfare. Another situation, we got um how many LMGs? I believe five, correct me if I'm wrong, we got the ASM one KB5 I believe Mac 11, we got the SAC 311, the Akimbo, and we got another one with this burst fire. Okay, so correct me if I'm wrong, I don't know if, I, if I'm 100% accurate right there, but let, let, let's say those are the guns that we have in this game. You got the SAC 11, <laughs> the Akimbo ones. Okay, you're forced to use Akimbo only guns, not all the time. Listen to this, no, not all the time you feel like using akimbo guns. How many times when you were playing, let's say, Black Ops, you know, you used akimbo? Sometimes you were using, let's say, the Scorpion for, for, for a while and you were like, you know what, let's go akimbo and see, and see how it goes. Because because you, you chose to use akimbo, not because you were forced to. So there you go, scratch one SMG off the list because you don't feel like using akimbo all the time. Same thing goes for the Burst Fire SMGs. Like burst fire SMG to me, it's kind of it's kind of useless. I mean, I'm pretty sure you can find videos on YouTube about it and people telling you great things about the gun. But the reality is, it's it's not like that. You know, it's not like that. Just because you got into a nice lobby and you got a good gameplay doesn't mean the gun is good or it's gonna fit this perfect. Yes, you can get some kills, but I just don't feel comfortable rushing with an SMG. That is burst fire, you know, especially in a game that advanced warfare where you die so quick, where everything is so chaotic, people flying around. So uh, to me, it doesn't feel right. So uh, scratch another SMG from that list. So then we got what we got: ASM1, KF5, and Mac11. 
I think it's Mac 11 or Mac 12 or whatever the name is. Anyway, you know what I'm talking about. The Mac 11, the Mac. I'm gonna call it the Mac. Oh, whatever the name is like on. You know, eh, it doesn't have that much range. It's it's not so great. You know, it was it had to be really close and and I think that the guy that I that I killed on that uh, clutch, the last guy, I think he was using that gun. You know, it, it needed more power. Okay, and and I'm saying all this before the the patch they really to the guns because I stopped playing Advanced Warfare, uh, Warfare right before that patch so probably you could say you know what the guns are different now but I don't know so anyways so it's crashed the Mac of, of the list and what do we got ASM1 K5 so having that Akimbo only and that burst fire weapon is just such a bad idea unless that Akimbo is a beast that gun needs to be a beast good range good accuracy good everything in order for for us to be using a Kimbo SMG all the time, so otherwise we're not gonna use it. So it's, it's less gun in the SMG uh, list for us to use. So then you're left out to pick two or three guns. So obviously you're gonna go for this one. Obviously you're gonna go for the K5. So it, it is not so hard to figure out why people use this gun so much because this is why you know there's other maps like. Um, instinct you know where yes you know if it's maybe uh, a soul rifle type of gameplay you know maybe try to kill the snipers on the other side and and you want a gun with, with better range you know uh, but for the most part people and, and and we love to use SMGs in this game because of that quickness so with all these new guns that are kind of I don't know kind of useless you know burst fire and akimbo only then you have nothing else to choose from other than you know this maybe two guns so this this is why it's one of the most used weapons in the game. So I don't think this gun crossed the line between being really good and overpowered. You know this gun is not overpowered at all. I don't know if anyone says that, and if you say that, it's because the you know it's lying to you. Okay, so this is this is not the case of being overpowered. It's just it good. It's good. It fits the advanced warfare, uh, fast paced. And, and everything and this is uh, this is the reason why people use it so you don't see many people running around with an LMG you know you don't see other people running around with the MK14 we used a lot of the MK14 in my over 3 or at least I did because it was easy to, to pick people out from a distance you know there was no flying around so it was easier to control um, flanks you know with a gun like that that's not the case here you got people flying all over the place it's it, you know it's not as, as let's say "Quote unquote easy, you know, uh, to use this gun uh, like MK14 or some of the S uh, SMGs. Another one, we got another a, a Kimbo LMG, for example. So you're being forced to use it. You, you don't feel like using a Kimbo LMG all the time. So it's crush another LMG from the list. So, so this this type of situation is what makes people use the same guns, or at least in Advanced Warfare, you know, in previous Call of Duty it was different, there was a lot to choose from, it wasn't like that, but at least in Advanced Warfare, I can't see why people use the ASM-1, you know, it's just because they don't feel like using a uh, burst fire SMG, you know, people just don't like a burst fire SMG, they don't even like burst fire assault rifles, so now, now you expect they're gonna use a burst fire SMG, or how about a Kimbo, you know, how many times you see, I posted an Akimbo gameplay not too long ago, it was, it's not that hard to get a, a good gameplay with a gun, it's just like, people, or a lot of you, or you my friend, yeah, you don't feel like using a Kimbo all the time, a Kimbo SMG all the time, so, th this is what you got, you know, ASM1, KF5, that's why those two guns are the king of the SMG, so I don't get why people get aggravated, you know, uh, when people just stick to these guns, I don't blame them, you know, and once again, sometimes, and you feel the craziness of, oh, let's use the Mac 11 and, and see how it goes, or, hey, you know what, let's go Akimbo, sometimes you feel in that mood of, of, of just trying something, something else, and just being, you know, being crazy and just rushing around, but it's not all the time, most of the times you play search, you know, you go to win, you know, if you have a decent team, you go to win, you go to destroy the enemy, you're gonna get the, get the kills, you're serious about it, so you pick a nice gun, so what do you pick, ASM1 or KF5, that's it, you know, so, I don't know, that's my take on, on the gun, Thank you for watching, my name is Wildchild, and uh, as always, if you haven't, please check out my channel, the videos, check out some Destiny that I have in my channel, Battlefield 4, the Resident Evil Revelations 2, uh, we live commentary, and there's some other stuff, uh, next gen stuff coming, so I will see you, my friend, in, in those videos, and uh, thank you for watching, alright, later.